So I just wanted to run through uh, re-foaming these speakers. I've already cleaned it all off. See there, I scraped it all down. Um, I cleaned off the cone. You can see it's a little scraped up um, just from all the cleaning. I used a razor blade and went around the edges, you know, rubbed it off a little bit with some paper towels and uh, rubbing alcohol and razor blades. Got it down to like just a rough texture. Um, this is the kit I got in the mail. Came with uh, foam discs. Came with two of the foam rings and glue. Um, these are like five and a half inch speakers or something like that. It's my center channel. <clears throat> it's like $300 new and uh, I didn't want to replace it. So I got these $25 rings. We'll see how that works. Uh, when I put it in here, it feels a little snug. Like it, it doesn't, it's like trying to pop out. You know, it's just a little bit bigger than what wants to fit in here. And I don't really want it to buckle. So I think I'm going to take this out and trim it down around the edge just a little bit and make sure it's going to fit in there without uh, pushing on it. So I trimmed these little rings down. They were a little too big. You see now I put it in there. It has a little bit of movement back and forth. It's not exactly pushing up against the edge. So I think that'll work better. Um, it should fit right in there. See it's got a little bit of play. So now I think I'm going to split these over and put the glue around the inside. You can put the glue on the cone, but then when you smear it around, it gets ugly because it gets on the cone and then you can see it when you're done. I'm going to try putting it on the foam. So hopefully when I lay it on there, it'll be nice and clean. Okay, so since this is such a small speaker, I'm going to try to just put the glue around both rings at once and turn it over and smack the whole thing down on there because uh, I think it's going to be too hard to try to get under that edge and get that glued down afterwards. So let's give that a try. So now it's glued down. Um, it does seem like it tries to pop up a little bit around the edges, so I just keep going around it, pushing on it. It's probably been about five minutes of uh, sitting here with my finger and just kind of going around the edges, making sure it's got a good seal. All right, so here it is. I've been, uh, you know, going around put my hands under here to support the cone and push around here get it all nice and smoothed out you can see uh came out pretty good a couple little tiny specks where the glue squeezed under um actually in this one this is the second one i did so i don't think i even have any glue drops uh this is the first one i did Still looks pretty clean. See a little bit of glue right up there along that edge. A little bit of glue there. I wiped it off with a paper towel like as soon as I got it on there, but it, it cleaned it up a lot, but not totally. So anyway, I've gone around. I squeezed this all down. I put this edge back on, and that also is pushing down on the foam on the outside edge. That was part of the frame that was already on the speaker. So that's it. Um, I'm going to let these dry and then uh, put it back together. So there it is, put it back together. You can see uh, it's pretty good. You know, the plastic part of the cones just uh, a little bit scraped up, but they're really small scratches and I think it'll look fine when I put it back together. Plus it's got a grill, it goes over the front anyway, fabric screen so you won't even see it. Um, I did want to mention that you know, some things tell you to take the center caps off and shim it and all that stuff to make sure it's not rubbing. Um, I don't feel anything rubbing, and I'll, I didn't do any of that. I just um, 
you know, these felt like they centered themselves up pretty well, you know, in this in the middle of the speaker without, you know, without rubbing the edges. So I just delicately put that foam on the edge and hope for the best. And, you know, as of right now, I don't feel anything rubbing when I push up and down on there. So I think we'll be good. That's it.